Last week was the glamorous video of announcing, ooh, I'm doing a capsule collection. This week it's time to actually get to work. You know, gotta figure out what I need, scheduling, orders, scripts, you know, the actual work of it, so. No time like the present. To figure out my supply list, I actually have to know exactly what the details of each piece is gonna be. Um, for the jeans, I used to have this pair of uh, salvage denim from The Gap. Really liked them. Eventually got too small. Basically want to remake those. For the athleisure pants, uh, I found this company, Public Rec. And what I've got in mind is pretty similar to these. Editing corn. Oh, already ahead of the game. Thank you. However, upon closer inspection, turns out that's a faux zipper. Oh, clutch my pearls, you know what I mean? No, I'm putting in a real zipper. I'm liking what they did in the back by hiding the zipper real nice and neat-like. So, thinking about how I can do a similar sort of thing in the front as well. That way, when I tuck things in and I'm active, I don't have to worry about losing it. For the button-ups, again, not reinventing the wheel. I've made a couple of these in the past. Gonna do the same thing again. However, the one detail I do like to do is with the placket in the front, fold over the fabric so that there's no seams and it's all clean and nice. And then finally for the crew neck, classic, no changes, just, you know, the way you see them. Raining Champ makes a nice one. That's my inspiration. As for the coat, I'm leaving that until the very end because, well, <laughs> So for now, let me put together a whole supply list of every little piece that I need. Headed in corn, please jazz it up for us. Make this <laughs> next section a little more spicier, interesting. Gave me love that I never knew I need. But she brought it so she got it in the bag. Got me eating out the palm of her hand like a Pomeranian. Popping her and singing about the rain. She won a hot Australian. I put a stop to that. I said, be the proper thing. Next, I want to get some labels into production. Just going to keep it real simple. The icon of my logo. Small, nothing garish, you know. I'm being rather clever here, I think. Uh, and I'm going to do a second batch in reverse to put on dark items so it doesn't stand out too much. Huh? And place order. So, in total, $98.80 spent so far on the labels. Add that to our ongoing expenses list. Future corn here. Uh, guess what? Just got some proofs of the labels. Pretty impressed with how they're looking. Looking forward to getting them. Onwards. Back to the future. Past. Oh. I'm going to be confused when time travel eventually comes around, you know? <laughs> Ooh. And then least inspiring for the very end, some script writing for a few videos I already have in mind, rough layouts of how I'm going to do them. So 